Stupid guys and their fucking horns. Piss me right off. Hello everyone and welcome back to Allegory Gaming. You are here with Mike and we are continuing our playthrough through Dying Light 2 Stay Human. We're getting a little farther along so don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and join the Allegorian community of fun and stories. Also, drop me a comment down below of anything you seem to think I missed or something cool you think that I would like to know. I would happily reply to all your comments. Thank you all, and I'll see you again at the end of the video. Let's do some trading. I'm gonna sell. I've got a bunch of shit to sell this guy. Sell all these bad fucking weapons. I'll probably sell these too. These will keep. Uh, resources. I can... Okay, we'll sell these too. healing. Kind of interesting. I gotta look what gear I have on. Let me, let's look here. What do we got on? We have some tank. I can use a better glove, racers, shoes, and jacket. We all need rest. Gloves. go with the medic stuff. So, how those go? Where's my gear? This is all my gear? Oh, I see. Ooh, so this has a little more armor. have a bow, so that doesn't necessarily help me. Or... Give a... Okay. Okay, that looks... Does that lead to the... Where's the double kick? I think we're going to take this. Oh, so the 
butterfly. Okay, here we go. There we go. Now we got a flame tip on there. Have a charm. I mean, we just take that. I like my katana. Oh, the Warsaw is better though. We should modify this though. If we can. Oh, yeah, we can afford another one of those, no problem. Okay. So we got a little bit of shit. Let's head back out there and look for some inhibitors. Should I help one of these guys? Should we do a quest? Let's do a quest, I guess. What do you got going on? Don't recognize me? Or are you allergic to making money? Ooh. Listen, pilgrim. I ain't allergic to we making money. We can make money. a killing, you and me. You just need to get me some beets, radishes, parsnips. There he is. Grab him, Ed. He's a murderer. What? Julian, Luke's been poisoned. From the water you sold him, Devin says. What? But... I don't sell water. Liar. Luke told me he got it from you. Ooh. Whatever's in it has him ranting and raving now. You're sure he didn't blame me after he started ranting? Uh, yeah, let's do this. Oh, wait a minute. Do you have proof? Yeah, I'm on this guy's of side. Of course. The water came in a bottle. Luke got that water in one of your bottles. When I tell Carl about this, you'll hang! Bevan, wait! I swear, I don't even sell water, damn it! If you're lying, Julian, you're fucking toast! This guy doesn't even sell water. Look, he's got fucking parsnips everywhere. Wait, so then, if you're not selling water, how'd someone get a hold of one of your bottles? Knowing that shithead Luke, he probably stole it. That would be like him. Even if he did, my water's pure as melted snowflakes. That's not very pure. So... Uh... Maybe it's revenge. For what? Everyone loves me. Never had an enemy in my life. Wait a second. Wait. Shit. Except maybe Marco. Who's Marco? That bastard. Come to think of it, he's got an axe to grind for me. It was a long time ago. Never mind. Listen. He lives above an old shop on the west end of Villador on Houndfield Lane. Okay. I traded him a few kilos of my finest flour for the water. Prove he poisoned it and half my flour is yours. Can you do that for me? Yeah, I guess I can check it. it out. We'll go take a look. And there's one more thing. Always a little, I'm a little embarrassed. Hans might also have a bottle of this water. I thought you weren't selling it. I'm not, except, well, to Hans and. Can you go warn him? He's also on Houndfield, a few buildings down. So we're going to Houndfield. Something's boys. fishy about this, Julian. Look, you better be telling the truth, otherwise, it'll be hard to help you. I didn't say he was telling the truth, so... So we're on the side quest, cheers. Making our way that way now. Okay, so we'll just head on this way. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. Going this way. Let's go to Hellfield. Got our flaming weapons on hand now. Should be doing a little bit better damage wise. Kind of want to test out. Kind of want to not save it. So. For this is the news of the last city standing. Okay, let's. Uh... Yeah, another one of those military convoys. <sighs> it's gonna be so hard to not do that. This way. Pretty far away. Here as well. Inhibitor container nearby. 
very close. Ooh. Closer. Oh, it's right here. It's in this building. I'm not going here. Ooh, it's a safe. We're going to need a code. Safe code. I'll probably have to oh, look at that before, actually. Collectibles. Uh, Safe code. 101. Get our inhibitor here so we can upgrade. Uh, it's literally one. Oh, we got one. Well, one, I'll take one over nothing. Oh, we got the roll. Okay, right on. And we got this. Do we go stamina again? I think we're going to pick up at some health this time. And then next time we'll, uh... Next time we'll grab stamina. We'll go back and forth between the two, maybe. Feels a little better now that I got the roll. Shitty assholes. Hey, little guy. Where are your parents? <laughs> I'm not little. Hey, you okay, are? sure. What are you doing here alone? I'm on an important mission. Oh, a mission, huh? All right, what kind of mission? Sacred mission, of course. Super secret, and I ain't telling you. Would you tell me if I offered to help? I don't need any help. But if you got to know, I'm fetching food for my parents. Mm. I do it all the Honorable. time. No biggie. Seems dangerous. Couldn't your parents at least come with you? Nope. Like I said, no biggie. I can handle it. I can handle anything. Hey, listen, you're incredibly brave, but I'd really like to help. I suppose I could bring you on board. Heck, I could even pay you. How's that? So now kids are hiring me. Why not? What are your orders, sir? There's a shop on West Horizon Lane, just before you hit the chemical zone. I was loading backpacks with food when those nasties showed up and chased me out. Bring me those backpacks, and I'll give you a super weapon. My a dad's super weapon. weapon. So, the mission's to get food for your parents. Yeah, that's right. And you can deliver it to our home. We live on the edge of the chemical zone. Only place where my parents are safe. Hmm. It would be best to get the backpacks at night, when the infected aren't around. Sure. If you say so. I don't know. But you'll do it, right? I can't promise anything. But we'll see. Ah, oh, okay. Well, see you soon. Hopefully. Okay, well, we've added that to the list to do. We'll, uh, we'll come back to the breadwinner. Where else, where else guys be? Here are these ones, though. Try out our new fire weapon. And then we'll, uh. Yeah, this is a good test right here. 
Guys up on the way. We'll pick this lock. Nice and easy. I haven't really played a game like lock picking and playing. Well, I don't know if I've played Skyrim or this game, or the first one more recently, honestly. Moving on, trying to get this quest done during the day. Stupid guys and their fucking horns. Piss me right off. flower and uh, that other guy was gonna trade me flower which is a little Between thieves and infected, I'll be out of business soon. Hey man, I ain't here to steal. What? what are you talking about? You came to rob me, didn't you? I'm here because a guy named Julian claims you sold him poison water. I didn't poison anything. All right? Uh, Julian claims otherwise. Sure. Listen to the guy who sold me flour mixed with plaster. If you're not the thief, how are you with infected? I need to get rid of those things that are down there. No, that's fine. If not, I'm done here. Poison water or not. Okay, I'll get rid of the infected, and you tell me what happened. Deal? Seems fair sure. enough to me. Deal. Okay. I mean... It's this guy's house, I shouldn't be taking a shit, right? Where can I get down here? The bathroom. Like, maybe I can go down that way. Is this a push line again? No. I think we're going down this ladder. Oh, 
electronics, vodka, another brick. Okay, well, that's everything down here. That's the brick, right? Oh, I've also got a search here. safe. On. Now, what's the story with the water? Go ahead. So you really are one of those fucked up pilgrims. You fucked, fucked up. up. Now we're safe. Gotta be a fucking criminal. Or pretty damn fucked up to drag your ass hundreds of miles through a world full of virals. Fucked up in a good way, of course. So, what about the water? All right. There ain't nothing wrong with my water. The man at the bazaar was poisoned. And you'll be blamed if he dies. <sighs> damn it. Okay. It was an accident. Okay? An accident. It's because of these goddamn thieves. Thieves? They're always stealing my water. I can't take it anymore. So, I decided to set the trap. So, you deliberately poison the water to kill the bandits? Uh, not quite. At least, uh, I didn't mean to. A, a while ago, I killed this viral that came crawling in here. And the fucker fell straight into a tub. The whole tub fucking ruined. But then I got this idea. Why don't I teach these bastards a lesson? So I filled some bottles with the zombie water, sent them out where they'd be easy to see. They were never supposed to make it into the bazaar. Guess I was sauced up and accidentally sold a few bottles to Julian. Look, I'll give you all the flour I got. I'll even throw something extra. Just don't tell anybody. I'd be ruined. They'll blame Julian and he'll hang. Don't you worry about Julian. A weasel like him will find a way to weasel out of it. I don't think so. And if not, then that's one weasel less in the world. So, we got a deal? Just be honest and tell your story to the bazaar. It was an accident. You nuts! No one would buy even a drop of water from me ever again! Man, I, I won't lying. let Julian hang for something he we didn't do. Here. Fuck Julian! I got my own skin to me? say. So that's a story you ain't going to tell. Yeah. Thank you all for watching the video all the way to the end. If you haven't already, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and join the Allegorian community of fun and stories. Also, as always, check out the story series on the channel. They're a very cool series where we go through games like a narrative book, and I think you'll love it. Most importantly, Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you next time.